Governor Samuel Lu increased minimum wage from 35,000 to 75,000 naira. <laughs> How true is this news? How true is it, Lagosians? The news in detail, please. The Lagos State Governor, Babajide Sonwelu, has announced the minimum wage of civil servants and public officers' salaries have been increased by 35%, by 35,000 naira since January. The servant who was earning 40,000 naira last year now earns 75,000 naira. Hmm. More details shortly. Well... Now, let me say this. Let's see if this is true. Because the minimum wage I heard as our last year was that the minimum wage was going to be increased to 35,000 an era. Now, let me even say, okay, fine. Let me see even if this news is true. Or more, the increment is not, permit me to use the word, it came at the wrong time. Yeah. It came at a time where the increment is not going to be seen. It's not going to reflect. You're still buying rice expensive. You're still and going to work, you know, your transportation for work. Compared to last year or last two years, it has tripled. Um, you, you know, rice is, I mean, rice is not, the, the rice now rise to 70,000. I don't know if it is 60,000 naira right now. You understand? Okay, fine. Let's say, okay, you do have bag of rice. What about other food items? What about transportation? What about health care? You see, it is coming. That is why I said it is coming at a very wrong time where the, the what's it called? The value of the increment is not going to reflect. It's not reflecting in the people's lives. So me, if you ask me what I want the government to do, believe you me, it is far from increasing minimum wage or increasing salaries. This is what I'm going to say. Let there be a regulation. Let there be a regulation in prices. Let there be a fixed price and let the price drop. For instance, now let them start selling um, gas. Let them start selling gas for 400 naira. They should work it out and let the gas everywhere, wherever they are going to, whether you are going to Abuja, whether they are going to Lagos, Niger State, Sokoto, Zamfara, you understand, Oshun, Ondo, it should be the same price. Number two, food items. All this, uh, what they call supermarket, they should also have a fixed price. They should not be selling 1,100 and uh, one naira when you know all else are selling one thousand one naira it should be regulated everybody will be selling at a fixed price petrol or should i say fuel would also be what everything both evasion for so that when the price of everything drop you see that small money with that is what is going to, and then they work on our what's it called agriculture agricultural produce and work and make sure they bring out goods or should i say product that we're going to be exporting that we're going to push out that is going to be our product not just one i say products so that is going to also give our naira weight do you understand it is only with these things that even the so-called 30 35 000 is going to be reasonable because come to think of it during jonathan's time they were earning 18 000 naira as basic salary right basic salary that's eighteen thousand naira they were in as basic salary rice was a half bag of rice was four thousand you understand beans you could know you understand now basic things things were okay then even the naira had more value then you could go to work you could come back people use that money marry enter inside their husband house enter inside their uh, you know marry wife boy children start with a stranger children for school do you understand it is very different now. It's so very, very different now. So even if they do it now, this is my opinion, it is not going to reflect. They should work on making sure our Naira is valued again. In fact, I don't know about you people though. I am a dreamer and I dream and I wish that our Naira gets to 150 Naira or max 200 Naira to a dollar. To be very sincere with you, I wish our Naira would get that kind of weight. 
he go lift weight, he go work on himself so thin. You understand? He go get that kind of weight for red dollar day. Do you understand? Uh -huh. And then if it is, if uh, let's let me um, let me say this: if after doing all those things, if after doing all those things, dollar now. I mean, there is increment in salary. Uh -huh. The increment will be making a lot of sense. It's going to be juicy. Do you understand? Very juicy. I ask, can 75,000 or buy a bag of rice from any Lagos market? Some of you should exist from this game of disease. Do you understand? The people are not going to appreciate it. The people will appreciate prices being regulated to how it was before. Do you understand? To the standard where people could afford two square meals per day, three square meals per day. Do you understand? To the point where there is middle class, there is lower class, and there is a higher class. Do you understand? To the point where you are doing things not because you don't have an option. You're doing it because you have a choice. You choose to do it. That is, I don't know, but that is what I want for this country. If minimum wages increase to 150000 per month, will the Nigerian police reduce corruption and vices? My dear, it was not going to happen. Corruption has been embraced. See, even if they start paying a policeman today, as of today, we'll they start paying them 250000 naira. The least person, the least worker. Believe you me, eh? They're still going to be doing what they're doing. It is in the blood. It is inborn. And it's in the blood. Immediately join a police force, except you fight it. You make sure that blood not touch you. I guess you don't know what the minimum wage is all about. Once government implement it, the least minimum salary you pay your workers is 75000 you are guessing the points that we understand it, but it is coming at a time where we are not, it's not going to reflect. That is what I'm saying. I understand it totally. I totally get it. Yes, people guess, okay, they will get to pay 75k. At the end of the day, you will see that the money, and the thing is, if they don't regulate prices and make sure the Naira has more value before bringing this on board, believe you me, people will define where the so called increments they You will be like, say, they will rob you. You understand? They will pay you, then you go and you go fish and rob it because things, I mean, that the never does not have value. You could ask yourself, what you use your money do? How much is the electricity bill per month alone? Not talking about feeding your family, house rent, and other expenses. We are now facing shaggy promise. All right, on those notes, we have come to the end of the news. So thank you for tuning in to listen until I come your way next time. Enjoy.